What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Hunter X here, bringing you guys another episode of the Modern Project. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. With that being said, if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it. With that being said, let's get into today's episode. Alrighty, guys. So in between episodes, I did craft some conversion kits. It is all up and working and dandy. It's all nice and uh, and all all that good stuff. So, are we using our induction smelter for anything? Uh, yes. So we're definitely gonna need some augments for that baby. And I don't think our compact is being used, so that's cool. So let's go ahead. Let's upgrade this this bad boy. Oh, that's the wrong button. So without any augments, this generates. How much are for tech? 600. With augment, 720. And we need, what's the other one called? Uh, U, increased dynamo output. So let's do uh, 64. Sure. All right, so if we max this out, by the way, how much is that gonna do? That is going to do 960 RF per tick. That's actually not bad. If you think about it. That's actually not too, too bad. Oh, do we, did we not hook this up? We totally forgot to hook that up last episode, I think. And that's fine. Oh, if I can type, that would be great. Item conduits. Oof, and then we can do a little bit of that, and disable you, and you, mm, wrong one, and you, and you need experience, experience, 49,000 experience. There you go. And now we are making essence of knowledge pretty rapidly. Um, one of the things I do want to work on today, though, is getting us some better power gen. Now, the petrified fuel generators is pretty good um, in terms of fuel or in terms of power. So I'm almost wondering how much would it cost? How much RF protect do you get if you use say pyrothium for example? I know in ozone you get 1200 RF protect. How much do you get here? 1200. Okay. That is not bad right that's not bad at all and go figure if we set up 12 of these right if we set up 12 of these we might be <coughs> in good shape by the way how are we doing here oh my god we're, we're so close like we're unbelievably close so i'm just gonna do a little bit of tick accelerating here and let that finish doing its iterations and stuff like that. So that's almost worth it, honestly. Um, what other options do we have? I want to save Rainbow, because Rainbow is going to be really cool, and it's going to be a really fun way to automate it. Um, right. Um. What do we have for generators? I want to work on power today. We could work on power <coughs> storage. Do we have mechanism? We don't. Okay. Because I was going to say we could use the induction matrix. That would have been a cool little thing. Um. We don't really have much of 
I mean, we have advanced generators. That might be cool to set up. Ender generators consumes dew of the void to generate power. Interesting. Uh, nether star generators. But do we have the witherless rose? <clears throat> we don't have the witherless rose. Uh, I think it's actually added by Roa Quarry. Right. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's set up this. Let's, let's set up a petrified fuel generator. How does that sound? Oh, it's so close. Oh, wait, we are. Superium. It needs... 900 iterations? What? That's gonna take a while. By the way, how much pristine ender dragon matter do we have? Okay, superior. Self aware. <coughs> Self aware adds a 42% chance. Um, right, so we're gonna need this guy. No, I want you. I want to blaze data. And there's a reason why I want this guy. Very specific reason why I want this guy. And you know, let's craft up a thousand stone. Oh, by the way. In between episodes, our 1638Ks finished. So that's nice. They actually got finished. So now we can store up. Uh, I'd help if you would actually put it in the right block. We should be able to store 131 million items now. That drive is completely full. This drive probably won't ever fill up. Ever. Maybe. 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 I don't know. We'll see. I mean, we're up to 7,100 already, but... Anyway. Anywho. Alright. So, let's go ahead and get ourselves... Oh, wait. You know, we were working on the blaze data module right all right let's also make sure that we get that and uh, you know what i also do we have i'm sure i can make one A, sw uh, a swab of a blaze and we can just make it a farm we can just make it a farm not that we need it or anything because we don't we've got an unlimited supply of uh, blaze rods All right. excuse me Gas, piss off. Magma creams, don't really need them. I need a blaze. Where are the blazes when you need them? Hey, spawn. Hey, I'm right here. Spawn. Are you? Okay. You take forever to spawn. Can I actually? Interesting. Oh god. Mistakes were made. So many blazes are spawned. Eh, it's whatever. It's whatever. It's fine. I promise. 
you know, not like the last episode where I absolutely broke everything. Like, quite honestly and literally. I lagged out for like 20 minutes. Because of my stupid ass. Mm-hmm. Awesome. Let me also get another swab. Just so if I ever want to switch it back to Enderman. Oh, wait. Are we getting dimwit parcels? We are. Okay. Damn, that's hard. We can always set it back up again. I don't mind that. <clears throat> Where is my staff of travel? Where did I deal with it? Uh, staff of travel. You just don't happen to be on my sword, do you? No. Where is my staff of traveling? Am I crazy? Uh, I must be crazy. Cause I have no idea where my s staff of traveling is. Imagine it's like right in front of my face. It's like, boy, you just blind as. Definitely not right in front of me. That's for sure. Oh, <clears throat> found it. I totally forgot I had to use it for a thumbnail like three episodes ago. Alright, hold on. I need you. Okay, now get me out of here. And let's also use that. That. Of course, I don't have any seeds on me. Because seems legit.com. Where you can get seems legit merch. And then we also. No, we don't want Enderman. We want Blaze. I need to make a spawner of just chickens. And I might even do a powered spawner if that. <coughs> just because. It's better. Alright, how do I redstone control this again? I don't think I do. Okay, I can just tell this thing to chill the fuck out for a minute. And then you. Wait, before I do that, before I make any regrets, hold on. Oh god. Hold on. I need to get rid of the Enderman. You know what? I have an idea. You do your thing. I just realized I'm about to die. So, give me one sec. This <laughs> is one sec. <clears throat> Everybody, please hold on one sec. Let me get my food on my hot bar. Let me get this in my offhand. That's not what I wanted. I wish there was like a way that we can automate this. Alright guys, I'm going to be here for a little bit. So tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and roll a time lapse of me killing blazes. And we'll be right back.
Alrighty, guys. So, uh, I forgot what we need. I think it's the simulation chamber. Yep, we need the simulation chamber. And then we need the loot fabricator as well. And this is going to be the guy that uh, gets all of our loot. Why do I... What's on fire? It literally sounds like my house is burning down. I have no idea. That's sketch. That's really sketch. So we're gonna go ahead and... Mm, do we wanna set it up down here? Or do we wanna set it up there? I feel like we should set it up up here. Mm. I don't know how I want to do this. I'm thinking, you know what? Let's move it down here. Since let's let's put it down here since it's gonna be an automation. I'm right, gonna put our blaze data module in there, and we're gonna grab an interface. Interface. <clears throat> you know what I should totally do? I should 100% make a, a conduit. Refine conduit. Because I think it would be much better that way. <clears throat> okay. Like, where am I trying to go? Alright, we're trying to go down a level? Uh, well, not really. We don't have to go down a level. If we don't want to. Cable. Alright, same exact thing. We're gonna want... A crafting card. A crafting upgrade of some kind. Yeah, I should maybe auto. I should auto craft this or something like that with poly clay. <clears throat> Sixty-four. It's not that difficult. You get your crafting upgrade, and then you get your your poly clay. You know what? As well, I think I'm gonna move my Ender Dragon one down here as well, and then we can get rid of this entire system in itself. Right. Yeah, we can get rid of this entire system up here. So what I'm probably gonna wanna do here then is teach you how to make conduits. You know how to make conduit binder already, right? Mm. You don't know how to make conduit binder? Well, now you do. Oh, we don't have gravel, though. <clears throat> Poops. That's fine. We'll be all right. I don't know if I'll be able to craft a stack, but half a stack of ener ender energy conduits should be more than enough for right now. Ender energy. So there is quite a bit of stuff that we still need to do. Right? It's still quite a bit to do, but you know. There you go. Get your conduit binder. I get my conduits. <laughs> Everybody's happy. 
So automating the way creeper doesn't sneak up on us. Alright, so uh simulation chamber. Uh <coughs> that's a plug, I wanna point. I wanna point to the system. Go. All right. And here's how I'm going to handle this one. And then we're going to go ahead and grab another simulation chamber. So conduit back here. And you will get. Oh no! Wait, this is already getting blaze. Yeah, something like that. You'll get your blaze. Wait a minute. Where is my data module? Where is my data module? Okay, I was about to flip my titties. Right. <clears throat> And then I'm going to put my loot fabricator here. Not there. Lol. Oh, this also needs power as well. So let's get it power. Power. <clears throat> and what I'm going to do is something a little different. Yeah. Ooh, that's why I want the conduits. Right, that's gonna be offline for a second. I want the conduits, these guys, the refined conduits. <clears throat> so that way I can run stuff from the back and not have an issue. Like, see, that still connects. That way I can run a conduit from here to there, <coughs> right? And then these guys, and then you. You're gonna be extract on green, extract on green, extract on green. And then you up here will be insert on green. Alrighty. Right. There's a conduit there. You're gonna be extract on green. Insert on green. Oh, these both gotta get poly, poly clay. Okay, and then that means I'm going to have to do a little bit of a trickery. But, if we grab a filter. You are not allowed to insert. You are blacklisted from inserting poly clay. Okay. So, go. Alright, awesome. That's running. Are you kidding me? I a 42% chance. And I still, I still get a failed attempt. 
it's basically 50 50. There we go. Perfect. <clears throat> I want you to go in there and make me sulfur. Okay. Pristine blaze matter. Is going to be exported from here. Alright, we're probably going to want some speed upgrades. Let's get a 10. Right. Okay. So this handles this entire situation. Right. So that handles that entire situation. Oh, that looks that looks clean as fuck, dude. Looks clean AF. All right, what do I want? 12 petrified fuel generators. Petrified. All right, I want 12 of these. 24 of these. Oh, a stack doesn't hurt. Stack of furnaces. Oh, I ran out of plastic. Ooh, that's another thing that we should probably automate. I totally forgot. That's something that I want to automate. <clears throat> I want to. I want to automate the production of making plastic. Because let's be real here. This is a big pain in the ass sometimes to make. <laughs> I swear to God, it sounds like something is burning inside my base. It's freaking me the hell out. Alright, awesome. You know what? Why I'm up here, crafting upgrades need to be taught. I'm using a lot of crafting upgrades. And I mean, I'm using a whole lot of them. By the way, our kit's done yet. Our kit should be done. It almost says like I'm saying kids, but I'm saying kit with a T. Yeah. I only crafted 10 of them. Alright, well, let's request like 10 more. What are we missing? Platinum? How in the... JV Joe and Lockers, is that possible? Oh, did I not set up on the platinum chicken? I never set up an extract on this guy. Okay, fair enough. When I were making platinum. Where is the platinum barrel? Oh, it's up here. All right. We should have enough platinum now to re request 10 more kits. <clears throat> OK, 
because I'm a savage. <coughs> I was one short. One kit short. Oh, I should totally... Out of curiosity... Can I craft... A stack of these? Why not? I don't see the problem. That's doing its thing. No, do I want draconium? I'm trying to debate whether or not if I want draconium or not. I mean, I do want it. But... <clears throat> anyway, let's get our, our generator set up. Right. <clears throat> I'm actually going to want its own interface for this. Interface and All right. we know how to make pyrothium already. So let's make a stack of it. Which is quite expensive and pretty baldy bold. Um I'm gonna want crafting upgrades just because I also need to break into the back wall here. Right. Yep. <clears throat> and this time I'm actually going to run the cable under the ground. Right? That way I can kind of save on conduits. So that way I can use normal cables. Pyrothium interface. We already know how this crafting card works. Oh, of course I put it in the wrong spot. Seems legit. Uh, you. No. Wrong thing. Totally wrong thing. Interface venue. Item conduit. You are going to be a crafting card and blazing pyrothium. You know what? 30 should technically do. This is going to cost a lot of sulfur, but I think it's worth it. And if I have to, I've got my sulfur chicken. 
That's kind of like a plan B type thing. If this blaze thing isn't enough to keep up with it. Yeah. They should each be getting blazing pyrothia. Now, I'm probably going to want 12 different plugs. That's fine. That's, again, super duper cheap. But, yeah, this is that, that's power, guys. That's power upgraded. We got our power upgraded. And I think that's a win right there, if I say so myself. That's definitely a win on our part. Just right now we don't have anywhere to store that power. There's actually a reason why I wanted to get into Draconic so early. And this was the reason. Like Draconic has such an amazing power storage. I want I want it like right now. So I'll just set all these up. Right, so if you figure 1200 times 12, we're producing about 14,000 RF per tick right now, which is not bad considering how much sulfur and how much redstone and stuff we have. Yeah, we're net lossing on sulfur, so I might end up just 10 10 10 10 10 10 10 10 our chicken. Right? Um, but yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Modder Projects, please do me a huge favor. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, ding dong that notification bell. Follow me on all my social medias, those will be linked down in the description. As always, guys, I'm going to love ya. I'm going to leave ya. Till next time.